Yeah. Do you remember wh wh where you were when you first, like, kind of... Uh... Um, I first met her, she came to watch me in a game in uh, London uh, with um, her manager at the time and uh, one of the other Spice Girls, Sporty Spice. Did you so know the Spice Girls? Did you... I, I knew, we knew of them, obviously, because they were pretty big at that time. Sure. Um, and I was just establishing myself in the Manchester United team at the time. Yeah. But we all had our favourite Spice Girl. So um, that was the first time I met her. Was and she always your favourite? She was obviously my favourite. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Might be a bit awkward if it wasn't. Um, <laughs> That's true, you're right. Yeah. Uh, so then the week after, I didn't get to talk to her that, that day, but the week after she then came back up to Manchester to watch another game. Um, and she'd had a couple of drinks, so I decided, why not, you know, I'd, I'd try and get a number. And we talked for about an hour in the players' lounge, and then she actually got the train up that day. So she, uh, she wrote her number down on her um, train ticket, which I still have. Oh, you kept the ticket? Yeah. yeah oh, that's so ticket. cool that you I kept that. That's amazing. And here you are 20 years later. 20 years later and oh four kids later. Gosh, that's wild. 